Manscaped is here to up your body grooming game. Manscaped has the revolutionary electric trimmer, the Lawnmower 3.0. It's cordless, it's waterproof, and it's guaranteed not to nick or snag your nuts or your chest because you can use it upstairs and downstairs. So go to manscaped.com, use code HRU for 20% off plus free shipping. I think that this personal theory from a personal experience talking to dozens and dozens of people is I really feel like cuckoldry for some people is kind of a gateway into allowing themselves to explore their attraction to men or masculinity. Mm. I find that a lot of cuckolds that I talk to really want, it's almost like they're into the idea of being with a man, but kind of being like forced into it a little bit. Like, Mm -hmm. like a lot of them talk about wanting to, um, the term that people use is bull, uh, wanting to suck the bull's, uh, dick after he comes like in your wife or wanting to lick the cum out of your wife's pussy or, uh, want to a lot of them stop at wanting stuff in their ass I find that most of them don't want something in their ass which is where I think that um not confusion but I think that hesitancy where it's like and that's where I think that having really you know specific language to talk about your attraction and the way that you experience your attraction to others is really important because I think a lot of these men have some kind of vague attraction to men or to you know, to dicks or to masculinity and they don't really know how to express it or explore it. And I think cuckoldry is kind of a way to almost safely explore that. That's so interesting. And, you know, I never thought about it that way, but that makes a lot of sense. And, you know, when you first mentioned that, it kind of made me think of, you know, what we call like the ravishment fantasies with women, like women who have fantasies about being, you know, taken against their will and like a CNC scenario, consent, non-consent scenario or consensual non-consent. Um, and I had, a I, I talked to Christopher Ryan on this podcast. This was actually one of my first interviews and he talked about, you know, we talked about the, the, the ravishment fantasy and you talked about the idea that, you know, a lot of women feel like they can't be overtly sexual creatures. They can't want sex. They can't desire sex because it's like not proper. You know, women are not supposed yeah. to be that way. And so this ravishment fantasy kind of comes into play because it's the idea of like, oh, well, I was taken against my will and like I didn't want to have this, but then I had this experience. And then I ended up enjoying it, even though like initially I didn't want to, because I'm like the good virgin or, you know, I'm the good girl. So, so it's interesting how like this, this denial that human beings, um, force upon themselves, you know, in terms of like sexual fluidity or, you know, what it means to be a good girl or whatever, then kind of comes out in these interesting ways in sex. Absolutely. I, t- I totally agree. I, th- I think, uh, you know, obviously there's, you know, everybody's different, of course, but I think uh, a lot of people have a really hard time expressing and figuring out exactly what it is that they're into and what they're attracted to. I think there's a lot of, you know, shame and it's confusing. And, you know, if you kind of stumble into something or a particular fetish or kink and, maybe it kind of freaks you out a little bit, you know, like if you're, you know, into consensual non-consent, I'm sure for some people it's probably a little confusing, you know, because yeah. you don't actually want to have, some, you know, an act of sexual violence committed against you. But at the same time, there's just something in your monkey brain that mm-hmm. just, you can't explain, but just wants that. And I think that that's, I think probably scary for some people, but it's really hard to parse that out. Manscaped is here to up your body grooming game. Their lawnmower 3.0 is a revolutionary electric trimmer that will not only not nick or snag your nuts, but can also be used on your chest hair. If you get it in the perfect package 3.0, it will come with a bunch of liquid formulas to keep you feeling and smelling fresh all day. And for a limited time, you can also get a free travel bag and anti-chafing boxer briefs that come with it. 
So go to manscaped.com, use code HRU for 20% off plus free shipping. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, make sure that you subscribe so you don't miss a single episode and go check out all the other videos. I film every single one of my podcasts. And if you want to listen to the audio version, I'm on iTunes and all the other podcast platforms. Visit hollyrandallunfiltered.com to find out more.